his points lead tonight, and we are green right about now on Michael Ledford. Ledford is going to lead him down into turn number one. It's Mike McKinney on his outside. Now McKinney will run down to the inside in turn number three. He's going to put throw a slider on Ledford. Ledford cuts it back underneath. They're side by side at the start finish line. Now it's Ledford's turn to throw a slider and turns one and two. Now McKinney, another pretty good run down the back straightaway into turn number three. He's going to throw a bomb once again on Ledford. Same thing, this time, once again. Great battle for that top spot. Currently in third, though, it's a Z1 of Zach Odewalt. McKinney, a better run down the back straight into turn number three. He's going to throw the slider again. My goodness, for the third straight lap, actually the fourth straight time, they're side by side. Michael Ledford and Mike McKinney are at the start finish line. McKinney, another slider right there in turn number four. This time, it's definitely Mike McKinney leading lap number five. McKinney went from one tenth of a from a tenth of a second lead to four tenths that time. Michael Ledford in second, Zach Odenwald about a second back in third. Great race right now for that top spot. It's died down a little bit, but it was still pretty hot there for a minute. With 14 laps to go, we'll see if Ledford he has plenty of time as Mike as Mike McKinney is ripping the lip. We'll see if Michael Ledford can mount a charge and make it come back with 13 to go. We're, we have a car turn around to the top of turn number two. Caution lights are not on. We are still green. That was the 98 of Jeff King. Mike McKinney starting to pull away now as he almost makes contact with the lap car of Jeff King, but McKinney starting to pull away, really getting that high side rolling for him. Battle for third starting to heat up right now between Zach Odenwalt and Ethan Weber. W Caution, light is out. Caution is out. We believe that might be the 67, and yes, it is. Caution out here in the pro, in the, excuse me, the UMP modified feature. For Larry Bunning in the 67. Oh, Honk and Cheeseburg, which is, they're pretty good. But here we go. Mike McKinney is going to try and hold off Michael Ledford. And we're back green here at Farmer City. Ledford's going to set sail up on that high side. And Mike McKinney, he's got the whole shot this time at, down the front straightaway. He's going to lead lap number 11. Caution out. Caution is out for the 98C. Guess what? The light is out. 
And we got three laps to go, and we're going to find out right about now. So McKinney with a great restart. He's going to go through that bottom, hitting the bottom near perfect in turns number one and two. And I bet he goes to the top in three and four. And yes, he does. We'll see if Michael Ledford can build up the comeback and get Mike McKinney. White flag is out for Mike McKinney. One more chance for Michael Ledford, and we'll see if he can do it. And it appears not. He's going to throw one more slider. Can't quite reach him, and Mike McKinney wins here at, Fer at Farmer City. Your winner here at Farmer City for the dirt car, UMP Modified Features, Mike McKinney. McKinney's already picked up a pair of American Modified Feature wins here in the past, but climbing out of the car right now to Plainfield, Illinois, it's Mike McKinney. So, Mike, Ledford, uh, you guys were side-by-side side right from the get-go, but then you set sail on the high side and pulled away and got it done. Yeah, I know. Uh, I knew whoever was going to get ahead of each other was probably going to win that race. You know, Mikey's a hell of a shoe here, especially when tracks fast like this. So, hopefully we put on a, a good show for all you fans. Thanks for all, uh, for all you guys coming out. Uh, any police officers, anybody in, uh, you know, in the law enforcement industry uh, here tonight, thank you guys so much for, uh, you know, keeping it all safe and, uh, you know, all of our communities. And, uh, yeah, we haven't been able to make it here too much at Farmer City this year. just hasn't worked out in our schedule, so just uh, glad to make it back and uh, come home with another win. All righty, great job tonight, Mike, and thank you for coming. So next up, we've got the super late models, and it's going to be a good one.